Hey DIYers, I'm George from Alarm Grid. Today we're going to be going over why you cannot use Z-Wave security sensors with your alarm system. Now, the quick and easy answer for this is because they are just unreliable. To this day right now, manufacturers, they specifically make their systems to not work with Z-Wave security sensors. And the reason for that being is that they don't think they're as reliable as their own sensors that transmit at a radio frequency of their own. Um, now, although Z-Wave has come a long way in the recent years, they have Z-Wave, they have the Z-Wave Plus, which basically offers you a greater range and uh, greater range and longer battery life for the Z-Wave sensors. Um, and they're even working on Z-Wave 700 series sensors. So as of right now, the systems, they work with Z-Wave devices that are intended for home automation, such as a door lock, a thermostat, plugs, lights, light bulbs, switches. Um, there's also a Z-Wave siren that you can use, garage door controllers. These are all Z-Wave devices that are the systems that Alarm Grid supports that the systems can use. However, if you're looking to do a Z-Wave motion, Z-Wave smoke detector, Z-Wave door window contact, these are all Z-Wave security sensors which do not work with the system. Now, as I was saying before, they, the manufacturers haven't made their systems compatible with these sensors just because they think it's unreliable. They also don't want, uh, basically, they don't want to be liable to where if somebody does break in through a door or window that has a Z-Wave sensor, since the Z-Wave sensor, if they ever do make it compatible, if it's supposed to work with the sensor, with the panel completely, the liability would fall on them and they don't want to, you know, get in trouble for not for the system not functioning correctly with a z-wave security device now honeywell dse quilsis power g they all have their own radio frequencies which are completely different than what z-wave uses and that's what they like to stick to now some of the panels actually do work um some of them have the same built-in receivers like for instance honeywell and two gig they both use 300 345 megahertz free frequency um, and th again these are just the frequencies that the alarm companies would rather use um, if you guys do have a system and you're looking to add z-wave to it most of them actually have the z-wave built-in or even z-wave plus built-in um, if you don't have z-wave built-in and you want to use z-wave devices keep in mind it's only home automation devices so you want to make sure that you pick and choose them carefully if you guys ever have any questions about what to use or how to add z-wave to your current system or if you're looking to upgrade to a system that does do z-wave you can always email us in at support at alarmgrid.com uh, if you guys have any more questions or anything like that also make sure you email in if you found this video helpful at all go ahead and hit like subscribe to the youtube channel and enable notifications so whenever we upload new content you guys do get notified i'm george i'll see you guys next time